All right, well, we were going to fly out of Orlando on Saturday night, but after that canceled, we couldn't find flights out of there or out of Atlanta, so uh, we got a rental car, and we're just driving straight to Charlotte. So and they say it'll be like eight to 10 hours, but uh, we'll still get home, you know, earlier. And it wasn't an issue of safety. I feel pretty good about, you know, if we had to stay here, we'd be okay, but I just want to see my family. I just want to be with my kids. So uh, definitely worth it, still get home. When I came to uh, Orlando from Nashville on Tuesday, there were enough stories going around Tuesday that I got spooked. And so I went and changed my ticket on Tuesday night. So I was gonna come, I was gonna fly out on Saturday afternoon tomorrow, and I moved it to tonight. But uh, it is just a weird, it's the weirdest convention I've ever been in. Because everyone's like, hey, where are you going to play tonight? Or what park are you going to? And now it's like, how are you getting out of town? How are you vacating Orlando? And it's just a very, very, unique experience but I feel a real communal uh, sharing and a, a lot of love and care for, for, for people as well I'm uh, I got I'm a little nervous I got two flights booked tomorrow just in case I can't get out of here and uh, gonna end up I'm trying to leave at nine I go to the airport in the middle of the night just so uh, I can brave the traffic and the I'm from the Midwest I don't know what to do with a giant thing that spins around <laughs> So I'm quite terrified, but I have another flight at 120 in case that one gets canceled, and uh, just do the best I can to get out of here safe and get back to my family and watch the Packers on Sunday. So. Yes, I was here for a conference. I was supposed to leave Saturday night, but with this hurricane coming, I I am not going to stay here. So I got to fly out earlier, uh, a day early.